Picking a pipeline data model, pods, APDM, or pod spatial. So many choices, so little time. Or so it appears when you have so many options for choosing a data model for your company and you need to make a decision on which one you'll be using. Depending on who you consult, you'll get many different opinions and recommendations. How do you know which one is the true gold standard for the industry? One of the reasons that this can be so hard to sift through the recommendations is there is no one best choice that fits every company. You just have to find the one that is best for your organization. This article is the first installment for a four part process that will help you select the best pipeline data model for your company's needs. Don't worry about being pressured into buying something in these videos. We have nothing to sell, at least not directly. We do offer three different data model solutions that can meet your needs, but we are truly neutral when it comes to recommending one over another. Remember when it comes to choosing a pipeline data model, it's definitely not a one size fits all answer, but we can help you with making a decision as we clearly know just about everything about each of these models including the pros and cons of each one. Three options we will cover for you include the pipeline open data standard pods www.pods.org, the ARC GIS pipeline data model, APDM www.apdm.net and the pod spatial model. Each of these three models offers a different data model solution. First we will review the pods model, next we will move on to the APDM and finally the pod spatial. By the time we finish our review you will be well versed in the main differences and similarities among the various choices. At the end of this four part series you will feel much more confident that you're making the right choice for your organization's pipeline data needs.